Hi, I'm gonna tell you why not to buy half lace not gold J series. This is a four burner hob that I purchased. Uh, it's just been April 2016 is when I purchased this hob, and um, now it's 2018, almost just like not even two years. And just within two years, uh, right about one year, I started. Uh, seeing trouble with getting this switched on so every time like just show you you have to just keep holding it and you just leave it it just goes off and second try it just comes up right and so I can show you with this little one it's always been a shovel from the day one of me purchasing it right so this is one of the troubles and I, I do I did ignore the other uh, part of it but what really took me down on this one is the durability of these burners so this is my work about that I have done to get this fixed for now let me just remove it so the reason uh, I put this foil is because you, if you can see the ring just in a mere span of two years with regular cleaning and everything has bent in all possible corners and you see the this difference that has come right this bend whatever has come it should ideally be sitting right intact like this however what you see right now is this Right, and this has happened just uh, in a span of one and a half years. Um, for the last six months, I've been trying to get some work around done on it and just been using, trying to use it that way. And um, I'll just put this back and show you how it lights up right now. Let's make sure it fits well. Yes, it's fit. Okay. And one more thing is this uh, covering which looks very pretty much neat in spite of daily cleaning everything it hardly stayed neat and nice for like not even a month and it just went black and like the regular old stuffs okay so uh, this one again has the same same trouble so all this I put the foil just to make sure the gas didn't leak and just and you see all this all this black um, thing coming off and because that's because every time I switch on the stuff this again oh, I hate this okay so this is how the, the 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 flame comes out it comes out a yellow flame not anymore it gives me a proper blue flame if you guys think that this is because of the uh, possibly the foil that I put I can just remove that and show you guys it's the same thing even without the foil the reason of putting the foil is to just help me so that at least for a few days I can get this to be done and I spent like how much I gave in I think around 26,000 for this entire hob and it pains my heart terribly that it was not even useful even for two years this is an utter, utter waste of my money, my hard, hard earned money. You see, again, I have the trouble with switching on. This is what happens. Sometimes it just looks and then, you see, just can't get... I have to hold it for a while, slowly release, the minute I release it, it goes off, that's what, and so even though I switch this on, the file that comes up is just the same, same bad yellow, yellow file that leaves all my utensils black and my house like, really gets done, gets really angry on cleaning them up, so you see how the flame comes up right so this makes all my utensils black like this this is what happens to all of my all of my vessels it's terribly bad yeah and this uh, let me show you the other one as well so you see how the flame is overflowing everywhere that's because the gas is leaking and the ring is not fitting on it anymore and the reason is you can see how bent it is right 
Right, so it's been the same pain with all the four burners almost. This one never stays up. So it stays up for a while and then you put something on it and it kind of goes off. And this one again, as I said. So yeah, so this has been um, the current um, bad, bad review i know i know it's really impressive when you actually see it looks so good and you really want to buy it but trust me it's just uh it's just a bad 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 uh investment really 26 i'm on 23 000, uh 23 to 26 000 is what i spent on this entire hob and that's a completely utter waste of my money and the worst part is now when i call them up for service uh, the so the service center is responsive not bad on that but uh, if you don't have a warranty the warranty usually is just for one um, year and if you don't have a warranty on this um, this just the ring to replace the ring alone this is what they call the ring is 2500 at least okay and um, then if you want to replace this whole thing i think it's like around three to five or k or something just one one part of this so imagine if i have to get the, my entire stuff figures like one two three i'm spending around at least easily um maybe like and so for this ring this small ring sorry it's hot so this small ring for this stuff it's uh 1500 just for the ring not the entire stuff just this Okay, it's 1,005 and for this, just this part is again 2,500 to 3,000. Yeah, so uh, the entire stuff um, charges to get this fixed would be uh, around uh, 25, 15, 15, which will be like 3, 2, 5, 5,500, 5,500 to get just the replacement of the rings and uh, uh, the entire servicing of it is uh, eight, around 850 rupees. So totally that cost me like six to seven thousand i suppose if i go back to the indian market and see something good i would easily get a hob which is maybe a two or three burner stuff or a regular you know cooktop kind of a the, the regular stuff which is not the inbuilt one it's just a regular one i get that easily with the three thousand rupees and still i save like around five four thousand so yes uh, with a heavy heart i'm just gonna take this up wrap it up and just leave it inside so nothing can be done about it because I really don't want to put another 7,000 on this after spending 23,000. Bad investment. Really bad. Bye guys.